Hi everyone, I said I was gonna make more videos and I'm making a very simple recipe today. I don't know where I got it from. I don't know if my mother made it. I don't know if I invented it. I don't know where it came from, but it's made with tuna. If you don't like tuna, you could use uh, the uh, canned uh, chicken. Anyway, it's a tuna pasta salad. And what I have done is I have... Uh, if you don't like tuna, you're not going to like this. <laughs> you Back can make you. it with chicken. Back to you. You could. But Whatever. <laughs> anyway, here's... A, I boiled a pound and a half of pasta. And this is the only time you ever rinse pasta. The cold water is when you're making a salad. Otherwise, you never rinse pasta. So what I'm going to do is take this pasta, get all the water out of it, and put it in this bowl. Getting right to it. <laughs> How's everybody doing? <laughs> I'm doing fine. And I didn't even drink yet. She, I didn't even take a sip of wine. She, I was just about to say they're going to think you're drunk. This is my first sip. Very, very simple. So you have the pasta. You put, I have four cans because I made a pound and a half of pasta. I'm gonna give you the recipe for one pound of pasta. And you, you, do, you double it, you do whatever. And I, two cans, two and a half cans, but we gotta chop up the tuna. This is four cans. This is four cans, for a yeah, for a and pound half. and a half yeah. of uh, pasta. So we're gonna chop it up, okay? Now, usually if it's, if it's, I do one pound of pasta with two cans or sometimes three, depends, but I use the white meat only. You use whatever you want. I'm a very easy cook. You, you do things to your own liking. I have about a cup and a half of mayo here. You would use a cup or if you want more. And you can also, if you don't like it uh, dry or it's not, it's not really dry, but if you want it m more wet, you can add a little milk or a little cream to it. No, nah, just stick to it. <laughs> um, everybody does it to their own taste. Oh, no, sorry. <laughs> and I have here a half a large red onion chopped. My grandson says I have to make some desserts. So I'm going to make some desserts, but... My specialties, I cannot give you the recipe for because I sell them. And they are cheesecake, carrot cake, and chocolate cake. Anything else I make, I can show you how to do. Uh, I do pies. I was just thinking you should do pecan pie first. It's simple and it's delicious. Pecan pie? Well, that's, yeah. for, th that's for Thanksgiving or, or even... Uh, it's coming up. Soon Halloween, yeah. <laughs> Halloween. I make a lot of pies. Apple, blueberry, peach. Oh, I make a humdinger the keep, peach pie. Keep going. Key lime, lorem, yeah. lemon meringue, apple lemon crumb, meringue. blueberry crumb, the peach butt. crumb, cherry but crumb. Good. She makes everything. Okay, see? That's just about perfect. This is a fast video. <laughs> One, two, three. This is really good though. You eat it and you go, all right, it's pretty good. And you have more. No, and you keep it's delicious. More and you keep more. If you it's like delicious. tuna. <laughs> and you keep eating it and you realize it's delicious. Uh, so I can make uh, chocolate chip cookies, but everybody knows how to make chocolate chip cookies. Don't you know how to make chocolate chip cookies? I can make uh, cinnamon buns, but my grandson says, that's a New Year's thing, Nanny. Save it for New Year's. 
I said, That's our tradition, not everybody's tradition. Said, yeah, your son is something else. Yeah. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, so I have it all mixed for you, and this is perfect for Labor Day. Also, Memorial Day, 4th of July. It, it goes be, great with a barbecue. It is Labor Day today, just so you know. Well, That's today is Labor Day. Happy I know. Labor when Day. When I see you, it's going to be a week after Labor it Day. It is. <laughs> and what I would do is put this in a plastic container and refrigerate it overnight. So it tastes best when it's chilled. But as I said a hundred times, whatever you prefer. We take a sip and then I'll take a taste. <laughs> Here it is. And as I said before, this is the only time you ever rinse pasta when you're making it in a salad. That's delicious. It's perfect. Until next time, I know I'll make it one next weekend. I'll make a video next weekend, I promise. Mm -hmm. Happy Labor Day.